Hi, I'm Chuck at Inline Tube, and today we're going to show you how to bench bleed your master cylinder. Start by securing your master cylinder into a bench vise, making sure that it is level. To avoid scratching the lid, remove the bales from each side using a screwdriver, then remove the cap. Now, attach the clear plastic hose to the short end of the plastic nozzle and do the same for the other one. Remove the rubber caps from the side of the master cylinder and press the tapered end of the nozzle firmly into the master cylinder port with a twisting motion. Repeat this for the other port hole. Be sure that the plastic nozzle is fully secured or it will begin to leak. Take the bales and move them into the center of the master cylinder and clip the plastic bridge in between them. Now, grab the end of the clear plastic hoses and push them through the holes of the bridge so that they are submerged in the master cylinder reservoir on each side of the wall. It's a good idea to place a pan under the master cylinder in case any fluid begins to drip. Now, fill both reservoirs with clean brake fluid. Be sure you don't overfill the master cylinder. Using a Phillips screwdriver, push the piston of the master cylinder in slowly with steady pressure in and out. Notice the bubbles in the clear plastic hose as they circulate to the top of the master cylinder. Keep pressing the master cylinder piston in and out until all the bubbles are completely removed from the hose and you have just a solid stream of brake fluid. Once all the air bubbles have completely been removed from both lines, detach the bridge and spread the bales apart. Cover the top of the master cylinder with the lid and you are done. If you have any questions on this video or any other tech support questions, contact us at support at inlinetube.com.